What's up, everybody? Another day in paradise here. In a quarter mile, use the left two lanes to turn left onto Avenida Vista Hermosa. Use the left two lanes to turn left onto Avenida Vista Hermosa. Continue on Avenida Vista Hermosa for one mile. Hey, good morning to the two of you that are in here. So I'm uh, on my way out to a tire change. Fun times, you know. That's the great part about telling you to do service calls, too. It's a roadside call, nothing crazy. And if I remember correctly, it's going to be like a Chevy pickup truck. Colorado or something like that. I got a flat tire. You too, buddy. You too. Who is that? You want to come on down to San Clemente and change the tire? <laughs> I've been trying to yap at you for the last, like, week, dude. You're not even existent, man. Go ahead. Go TR and you go off the uh, off the range there, huh, buddy? <laughs> oh, fun times. Welcome to the hill. In a quarter mile, turn right onto Camino Vera Cruz. San Clemente is like one giant freaking hill. Let's see how much fun this is. <laughs> Actually, I don't turn right onto Camino Vera Cruz, then turn right onto Calle Aqua Marina. Um, you may have to reset it to me. Horrible, that kind of stuff. Sometimes I don't save it right away and then I lose it. Yeah. Take the next right onto Calle Aqua Marina, then turn left onto Calle Onis. What the heck? Oh, all right, it's this place. Oh. It is a gated entry. Yeah, we're not going in the exit there because that's. Uh... Take the next left onto Calle Onis, then turn right onto Calle Jade. Okay, so what the heck here? I do not see a keypad or nothing. Alright, oh, right, I got it now. Thanks, Nick. Uh, let's see here. Residents, all visitors use Calle. Frontera entrance. Gate arm closes after each vehicle. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, okay, I need to look at my map here so your camera's. I have to call my customer, so give me a moment here, guys. Alright, we're back. I gotta go to a different gate unless somebody wants to pop in and let me in this one. Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. Well, let me see if one of these people. Nope. <laughs> Too bad I don't have any uh, plywood on the truck. By chance be able to open that gate for me would you okay no problem I know I got to go around the other gate thank you it's okay give it a try she pulled out see if she's got a clicker in 1,000 feet make a u-turn at Calle de los Arbolas Back out to Vista Hermosa we go. All oh, gated uh, communities. GPS will take you to the gate closest. Unfortunately, it's not the gate I can get through unless somebody's got a clicker to let me in. That's why there's no keypad. 
<laughs> so I've got to go to Via Turquesia or something like that. Has that like queasy sound to it. Alright, well now that I'm sitting at a light here, let me see if I can play with the camera. Yeah, that's better, isn't it? Red traffic signals. Try to get you there without covering you up. Well, y'all get to watch me change a tire. It's fun times, that's for sure. Nah, it should be an easy one. Chevy Colorado. Hopefully it's a rear tire. Well, front tire, rear tire, it doesn't really matter, I guess. It's a little baby truck. How many miles did I just drive to get here? One thing about this account is you have to record how many miles you drive to the vehicle. So I've driven 18 miles so far. In a quarter mile, make a U-turn. You're not smart enough there, GPS, to know what... Yeah, welcome to San Clemente. We're having crappy signal. Okay, so here's Turquesia. Turquiza. I still wouldn't have named it that. <laughs> Via Turquoise or something like that. It just has a wacky name to it. Turquizia. Dude, you could have just waited for the, the light to change in your favor. Actually, the light did change and allow pedestrians to cross, but you still jaywalked. I love people. He was getting his jog on and crosses the street like 15, you know, 10, 10 feet or so from the crosswalk. It gets annoying. The crosswalk's there for you. So you're too deaf, dumb, and stupid to use it. Oh well. And if you get hit by a car, the car's gonna be. In a quarter mile, turn right onto Camino Vera Cruz. In 500 feet, turn right for Via Turquesa. Right, turn right toward right, Via Turquesa, right. then turn left onto Via Turquesa. <laughs> Guess who? In 300 feet, turn left onto Via Turquesa. Champy. I wonder what that really meant. How you doing? 2528, uh, Kai Jade. Hello, double security. Yeah. I'll be a tow truck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Alright, you too. Thank you. Alright, let's see where I'm going. And I'll try to park the truck and you guys get to watch me change the tire. Fun times. Take the next left onto Calle Aqua Marina, then turn right onto Calle Onis. Right, left, right, right, left, left, right. Left, left, right, right. Take the next right onto Calle Onis, then turn left onto Calle Jade. There's like roadside assistance? No, I don't know. I just brought a tow truck for the hell of it. <laughs> she starts cracking up. The smile is priceless. Too bad you guys didn't get to see that. Take the next left on the Kai Jade. In 800. Destination is on the left. I don't know about the 800 feet part, but alright. I'm looking for a pickup truck with a flat top. Let me go in and get some paperwork done. It's a rear flat, it looks like.
We're gonna get started changing this guy. Uh, 19 miles to the vehicle. I can knock him out quick if I really want to, but I'll take my time.
right, that's all she wrote for a tire change. Let's see, uh, what everybody's yapped about here. Oh, suck it, Nick. <laughs> hey, guy's old, Big Red. Come on. What's up, Big Red? Milk Fresh, hello. Looks like that's the rest of you guys. Yes, Nick, I got your message. I just haven't messed with it yet because every time I mess with something on my phone, it uh, kicks me out of the live stream. All right, well, time to drive out of here. All right, I'm going to put you guys on hold for just a second here. I want to check something. I'm thinking of going to Costco here in San Juan, but... I don't know. All right. Ten times before. I don't know, man. Like I said, memory sucks sometimes. Now it's time to get the heck out the here. All right. I'm gonna go out the side I think I was supposed to be stuck in. The side I couldn't get inside. Try to see if I remember which direction that is. Yep, that's we hang it right here. See this game was so much closer. Come on, the guy lived here. He could have came over and buzzed me in. Oh well, what are you gonna do? need a clicker so technically all I need is a key to open up that DKS box and program a remote to it yeah, yeah people might get a little weird if I did that though <laughs> done that for some apartment complexes I've had to routinely go into pop the box real quick and get the code for the gate usually it's not even locked on half of the crappy apartment complexes What about the video? What, what? Dang it, just click on something and YouTube wants to say hello. Oh, yeah, it'd probably work better if I tapped a live chat. Oh, the, well, dude, you gotta recharge your phone battery, man. Come on now. You know that's always the issue. <laughs> Don't you hate it when that happens? Something good you're watching and all of a sudden uh, your battery's going dead. Dang it. It's alright dude, I'll find something better to send you. Aren't you a part of the NSFW group? <laughs> I was going to say, I think you've seen plenty of better ones. Most of the time, the stuff I share is just out of that group. <laughs> Big Red, are you still there? Or did you jam out? So I think I'm going to lose signal here in about two seconds. I was driving over here. Nick, you know who Big Red on here is, right? It's uh, TNT or SNS, whatever you know name he wants to go by. Transport. And read that last comment you put, Nick. Okay, the moment here. Things are much as they're bouncing around on the screen for you guys. They're bouncing around worse for me. truck needs a wash. I was saying, you know who Big Red is, right? Let's 
go over to, uh, we're, we're close to, go over, take a little cruise over to, uh, Capo Beach. Well, eh, Capo Beach, El Camino Real, it's kind of something like that. It's not exactly Capo Beach, but, you know, we're right next to it. We're an exit away. Ain't got Pico, Presidio. Yeah, it's SNS Transport. Oklahoma, the Oklahoma boy. They don't have a problem with you, Nick. They just have an issue with the TikTok stuff. I guess they, you know, they want more shit that's like crazy off the wall stuff like they post. Uh, you know, it's like, the it's like the difference between hardcore and softcore. Yeah, what you're posting is softcore. They're not, they're just not, you know, not exactly into that stuff. Um, I mean, I'm not knocking you. There's no rules on what you can post. I mean, there was only two rules in that group of what to, what you could post. And those two rules are stuff that, you know, it's moral rules, you know. Nothing to do with children and uh, no, like, snuff kind of videos saying too much on YouTube already I, even this day and age though, what the hell is snuff anymore that's like 90% of Pornhub and red, red tube and all the other stuff homemades no snuff I mean I, I think I had to go back and look up re-look up the term of what snuff is I think it's like stuff where you secretly record people. Something like that? I don't know. I remember an episode of CSI where they were doing an investigation on a murder. They couldn't find a body or anything. They had a hard time finding the scene. All because they found a snuff video. And it showed the lady being murdered. Well, they wanted, you know, they wanted to solve the crime, though. <laughs> That's that show, the original CSI Las Vegas. You know. Yes, you've talked to him, Nick. Plenty of times. Probably just don't remember. Avenida Presidio. Avenida de Australia. Welcome to like the Rich Beach area. Uh, San uh, San Clemente, El Camino Real. I guess that we're close. I do it. I'm gonna stop uh, store up here. I'm gonna probably hang over here a little bit today. Usually I'm more towards the other end of uh, South Orange County. Uh, today, uh, I kind of feel like being down, wait, down the deep south today. I haven't gotten out much. I've been cooped up at the shop for like the last week, so just gonna kind of hang over here. There's a Ralph's up here. It's got a nice sized parking lot because everything's tiny over here. I'm trying to find a spot to sit and chill with a big ass tow truck is, you know. Can be uh, fun at times. Let's see what we got. Ooh, they got a Verizon store. What the hell is this? Sit and sleep. Doesn't look like anybody's sitting and sleeping in there today. Yeah, you see how tiny this area is. One of these days when I go to Laguna Beach, granted I avoid going there like the plague, I'll take you guys along with me and you can see how horrible the streets over there are. It's, it's bad up there. It's really bad. Well, that's a good way to freaking kill the home values in the neighborhood. Put a Bank of America. <laughs> Sorry, B of A. You guys suck. Never bank with you again. Ever. Oh, wait. Avenue Presidio. 
Oh, I got off of Paula's auto. That's right. I was like, wait a minute, where'd I go? Yeah, it was pink. I mean, yellow. Used to be a gas station right there. There's a couple auto shops right here. Right here are the good places. I've done a few toasts of those. The ones we just passed on the right and the left. Yeah, you can see, trying to find a parking lot over here. There's a 7-Eleven down the street. There's another 7-Eleven up the street here, but their parking lots are screwed off. Like, the only two places I'd park over here is uh, here at the Ralph's, even though they have a small parking lot, or uh, there's uh, like a burger joint right off El Camino Real. Well, we are in El Camino Real. I'm saying off El Camino Real, crossing the five. Um, the place is pretty well closed for the most part, so, yeah. Well, I want to park far enough away that I don't mess with people, but at the same point, I need a spot that's big enough, so we're going to go right here. Parallel parking. Four spaces long between two vehicles. About how much I need as long as I don't put my stinger into Ford Ranger. Get out and look. I can back up about another foot. But I think... Uh, I'm just going to call it right here. Just hang here for a little bit. Oh, well. All right, we'll come back to this uh, live in a little bit. I get another call. Um, yeah. I'm going to watch some uh, TV on here, but we're pretty close to the beach. If we look out this way, you can see that's San Clemente Beach. Zoom in there. You know, a little bit further down the run there is uh, San Onofre. Uh, yeah, I mean, this is like the old richer, kind of ritzy uh, community for uh, tired people or older white people. <laughs> I don't know. You don't see nobody hiding down here. I did notice today, though, that the uh, the signs on the freeway don't say anything about COVID-19 now. They've gone back to buckle up, save a life. You know, they've gone back to the norm, which is kind of a good thing. It shows how fast we're getting over this stuff. Oh, there's a 7-Eleven I was talking about. Yeah, see? When I pull in there, I usually have to park on the dang sidewalk. There ain't no real way to park there. Been over here too many times. Um, because they get a burger joint there a lot of times when they pull somebody over off the uh, southbound five right here they'll pull them off and it cur the exit hangs right and they just go right there into that parking lot because it's the first parking lot there's a, I think an auto zone or an O'Reilly's right on the other side of that building there another little gas station what's going on Jacob just uh, chilling here for uh, Sunday Get out and do a roadside call. I'm already done with that. You don't have to go back and rewatch the early version of the live stream. But anyway, I'm going to get out of here for a moment because uh, I need to go use uh, Ralph's facilities. Nature is calling. So I'll yap at you guys later. We'll go back live again today at some point. All right. Y'all take it easy. I'll see you on the next one.